everybody, Laura Longo here from lauralongo.com. Hope everyone is having an awesome day. Came on today, this will be a really quick one, but I came on today because I um, ran into the swim doctor today and he gave me a few really great tips that I thought were really powerful. Whether you're an athlete, swimmer, uh, whether you are a business owner, network marketer, or just a person who wants to get better at what you do every single day. So when you come on, would love if you said hello. I'd love to know who is watching live. And if you watch the replay, shout replay in the comments below so that I can give you a shout out later and um, circle back and say hello and thank you for watching, right? So, again, I was about to get, I, I went to the pool to do um, some swim drills, right? And I was just about to start my set and I, the swim doctor came over and gave me a few tips. So the first tip that he gave me was like kind of a technical one, but metaphorically super powerful too, right? And what he said was to Remember to stretch and reach and get as much out of each stroke as you possibly can, right? So metaphorically, right? Basically, you're making this effort. And just push for that little more and get the most out of, out of your effort along the way. So I don't know if you've read the book um, Compound Effect or The Slight Edge. If you haven't, it's total. They're, they're both really great. Um, but really, basically what they say is the difference between average and extraordinary is just a little more effort compounded, compiled, day after day after day after day, right? So super powerful, I thought that was. And um, the second tip he gave me, which kind of took me off guard because I hear this all the time um, in business in our, from our business mentors and our um you know, our coaches and whatnot, but never really from a, an athletic coach. Uh, and his tip, his second tip was to think of something that you're grateful for and focus on that. Because that positive energy is going to propel you and it makes a huge, huge, huge difference in your outcomes, in your results, right? In your workouts. So super powerful. I love that. And the third tip he gave me was to envision where I want to be three to five months from now. And in the meantime, practice excellence. So practice your excellence, he said. And he also said it's the progress that you make. The progress is what gives you joy, right? What powerful words, right? So like what, like I said, whether you're a runner, you're a swimmer, you are an athlete, you run an online business, you're a network marketer, whatever it is, whatever you are, like super powerful, right? <laughs> so really great stuff. And it's funny because I run a network marketing business online mostly and um, also a triathlete. I was a triathlete first <laughs> and then I started my business. And from the day I started my business and got involved with working on my mindset and all that stuff, right? I noticed so many parallels between network marketing and triathlon and probably relate to pretty much like most athletic endeavors, that endeavors, CrossFit, whatever it is, right? But some of them, like, you know, both of us, network marketers and triathletes, we tend to get super obsessed <laughs> with what we do. You know, we talk about it a whole lot. <laughs> um, we strive to get better at what we do every day. We push ourselves out of the com our comfort zones to make progress, to get better at serving, to get better, to get the most out of our bodies, right? So this kind of, you know, his advice today just kind of reminded me of my sentiments back then when I was first getting started and it's like, wow, this is really similar <laughs> in a lot of ways, right? Um, so I don't know, that's all guys. I hope you are totally rocking it today. I uh, hope these tips can help you out like they helped me. Uh, love you guys. Thank you for watching.